Okay, so I need you to take a look at the patterns on these cute little moths and their wings because do the patterns remind you of anything? Okay, the patterns on the back of these moths' wings look like the eyes of jumping spiders. Jumping spiders eat moths. So moths are like, mm, how do I not get eaten by jumping spiders? And it turns out it's by looking <laughs> like them. Yeah, jumping spiders have really good eyesight for spiders actually, so they can see details on their prey. Details like patterns on the back of the wings. Patterns that look like the eyes of other jumping spiders. And so jumping spiders actually have pretty complex social interactions between themselves. So if they look down and see the eyes of a jumping spider, they switch out of predator mode. They don't recognize that as a moth. It turns out that over evolutionary time, many insects preyed on by jumping spiders have independently evolved this mimicry as a form of predator distraction, which essentially means that over millions of years, a predator has caused the image of its own face to appear on the wings of its own prey. I mean, nature is crazy. <laughs>